Well, May is over and Barack Obama's job approval rating for the entire month of May was 47 percent. We can put that May rating in the context of other presidents who were seeking re-election in May of their re-election years and see if that gives us some clues as to Obama's probability of getting re-elected. First of all, let's look at five presidents who won re-election and where their approval ratings were in May of their re-election years. These are Bill Clinton, Ronald Reagan, Richard Nixon, Lyndon Baines Johnson, and Dwight Eisenhower. All of these individuals had job approval ratings in May of the year that they sought re-election above 50 percent, and in some instances, as you see there, well above 50 percent. So Obama, unfortunately for him, is not up in the territory of those five presidents who won. However, look at these two presidents who lost, George H.W. Bush in 1992 and Jimmy Carter in 1980. Their job approval ratings in May of their re-election years were down right around 40 percent. So Obama's current 47 percent, certainly above those two losers. He's kind of, I would say, in the middle. And that's reinforced by this fascinating finding. Two presidents in May of their re-election years had exactly the same job approval average as was Obama in May of this year. And they were George W. Bush in 2004 and Gerald Ford back in 1976. Now, what happened? Well, both Bush and Ford went on to close elections. Bush won, he beat John Kerry in 2004, but only by three points in the popular vote. Gerald Ford, he lost to Jimmy Carter in 1976, but he only lost by two points. So it looks like that having a job approval rating where Obama's is now 47% predicts to a fairly close election. Bottom line out of this, Obama's current job approval average in May does not predict that he's going to sail the victory like has happened to some other presidents, nor, as was the case for Bush Sr. and Jimmy Carter, does it look like he's going to lose badly. What it really looks like is what we know now looking at the presidential ballot, it looks like it's a close race. Obama's right at the cusp there of where he would want to be to win or where he wouldn't want to be to lose. We'll wait and see what happens on November 6th. I'm Dr. Frank Newport, Gallup Editor-in-Chief.